and new land. Please only listen to this when you can safely close your eyes. My website is jasonnewland.com. If you'd like to support this free service, then you can go there. And there's a gift me page and PayPal link and all that stuff. I hope that you're well. And for this recording, I'm going to do something a little bit different. We're going to focus on a limiting belief. You're going to focus. and I 
conscious mind thinks that what you want is to be tossing and turning for hours. So that's what you get given, because that's what you asked for, as far as your unconscious mind is concerned. Doesn't understand the difference between negative and positive. focuses on what you're focusing on, which means we need to focus on what we do want, and to start to expect it to happen, such as lying down on your bed, your head touches the pillow, your body relaxes completely and your mind slows down. sensation of laying on your bed, feeling relaxed and calm, because it's pleasurable to do so. It's really nice just to lay down on the bed. And if you really want to get an idea of how nice it is, time, maybe just as you got home from work or you just been to the gym or you just been to the shops, just lay down on the bed, not to go to sleep but just lay down and feel how comfortable it is and how easily you could fall asleep. don't want to go to sleep because you're busy, you've got things to do. At that time, so imagine that piece of, long piece of metal, something you can hold on to each side safely. stays bent and then you just bend it back again and it's got those words of that limiting belief that you you had before you listened to this recording regarding your sleeping situation whatever the words may be that thing that's been holding you back that sentence that you've been saying to yourself and maybe others, telling other people, oh, I'm this, I'm that, I can't do this, I can't do that, whatever it is, connected to your sleep. And just imagine bending that piece of metal. And remember, this is your imagination. You don't have to be physically strong to do this. You can do anything in your imagination. So bend the metal down and then straighten it up and then bend it upwards and then straighten it up. And as you look at that sentence, that limiting belief that you used to have, Notice how it's getting a little bit distorted by the way you're bending it. And there's almost like a little crack down the middle. And it doesn't, it's not easy to read anymore. It doesn't quite make sense anymore as a sentence. And now bend it down again back up straight and bend it up to the top and then bend it straight. 
is getting weaker and weaker and you can turn it around and you see there's a crack and there's actually a crack in the metal not all the way through but partly actually it's separated you can see through part of it and not only is that old belief that was written on there that sentence it's not only blurred and not really able to be read but it's almost like it's partly been erased you know half of it is gone kind of and it's only half left which is a bit weird but what we're going to do now is bend it ten more times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Considering how how tough it felt at the beginning, how strong it felt at the start, now it's so weak. There's almost nothing holding it together. As you look at it, you can see there's a a gap on or going all the way down. You can see through it, but it's only a few little bits that are connecting it together now. And you know that one more bend of it and it will break. But you have to be ready. You have to be prepared for that to break. You have to want it to break. You need to be prepared for the changes that will occur when it breaks. Because that limited belief is broken it will be broken and you can't put it back together once it's broken it's broken for good which then gives you the opportunity to embrace your own belief such as sleeping is easy and that's what will replace that belief as you break it you just say those words in your mind and you think about it and what I'm going to do I'm going to count down from five from 5 to 1 I want you to focus on that new belief that you want to replace the old one the new positive belief worded positively about what you want what you need what you expect and just say it 5 times say it after number five say it after I say number four focusing on that emotion say the words after number three focusing on the feelings that you have in your body in your mind as you focus on that positive idea that new belief 
say number two, focusing even stronger on that belief, imagining it actually happening, and knowing that it's going to replace that old, limiting, outdated belief that's about to be broken. Say number one. Say that sentence to yourself or out loud and just break that piece of metal by bending it one last time. And when it breaks, you'll feel something. You'll feel that new belief, that new positive belief. a sense of sleepiness, tiredness, positivity and optimism, knowing that actually from this day forward things will change because of this new belief that's replaced. <laughs> 